never ready for this. Every good story ends with cha cha. Good afternoon, everyone. This is David Hoffman from David's Bin here, coming at you from Batumi in the Republic of Georgia. Today, I'm taking you to explore the nightlife scene here in Batumi. We're starting off here at Maximus Brewery, the only craft brewery in the city. We're running a full tour, try some beers. Then from here, we're going back to the center, and we're going to Ajarian House to try some delicious Ajarian cuisine. I'm super excited for that. And then after, we're gonna hit up a few bars and see the nightlife scene. Follow me inside. Tim, you excited? Yeah, absolutely. I tasted one of these beers last night and it was super delicious. So i interested to see the rest of it. Come here, Jovas. Come here, Jovas. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Hello. Hello. How are you? Beso. Beso. <laughs> Entering the facility. What do we have here? David, okay. pleasure. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Here at Maximus Brewery, they produce right now four different beers. Two different lagers, a regular one and a dark one. They also produce a wheat and an ale, right? And they told me to just pick one of these. So I'm gonna pick the smallest one. <laughs> no, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> this one, this one. This one's good. So for real, just take this and we go and drink? Your turn, pick one. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, they're all so pretty. I like this one on top, but it's very high to reach. Yeah, this one. All right, let's get it. Oh my God, it's so huge. He went with the biggest. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And this is the brewery. Wow, huge facility. They got, I'm guessing, 12 different tanks over here. You got four over here. They got the kegs in the back. And I think we're trying beer directly from tanks. That's how it's gonna work here. It's gonna be great. VIP tour. No one else is getting this. But obviously you can find their beer in town at many of the different bars. Here we're pouring their wheat beer. As you can see, they have like a spiral coil and the wheat comes out, right? Wheat beer. That's mine? That's yours. That's okay. Come on, Joss. Come on, Joss. Come on, Joss. Come on, Joss, my friends. Oh my god, it's like freezing. Oh, nice and cold. Oh, nice wheat beer, light, right? Straight from the tanks, the best way to drink it. Mm -hmm. Fresh. So fresh. Oh. Uh, two, four days and finish. Oh yeah? In four days, it's ready to go out to all the bars and restaurants, hotels around the country. Awesome. Young, but delicious. Thank you, Marjus. I'll finish my beer, bro. This is a good one. Oh my god. We're trying all four, man. Or at least three. I'm not pouring this one out, it's too good. This is dark lager, right? Got my jaws, my friend. Got my jaws. 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 Oh, a lot of head here. Mmm. Nice. It's creamy. A little creamy. I think what beer is it fills you up. Look at this guy drinking an entire liter. This is like the German style. <laughs> we don't drink small in the game. No, I know, I know. Breweries don't drink small. That's why you drink lagers, because if not, you get too messed up with the ales, man. The ales super high. Oh, it's good. So they're selling their beers in a couple of different places in Batumi, Tbilisi, and Rustavi. Uh, it's mostly in their personal shops, like the shops associated with Maximus Brewery, but you can still find them in a couple of different bars. So this is not actually beer. It's like beer without alcohol. Whoa, it's hot. <laughs> ah, you're crazy, dude. <laughs> Where my hand? I'll wait a sec for that. But I'm gonna also try right here their German Pilsen. No, German Lager, German Lager, sorry. It's already affected me. One beer deep. Mmm. Oh yeah, it's nice. It's light. Mmm. Creamy too. This is like, they're all creamy. It's all good. <laughs> all our beer is good. All the beer is good. You, you Ruski? No. Nazdrovi. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And right here, we're in their brewing system. So it's a few different barrels. Wow, look at that. I actually haven't seen that in a while because they're actually making beer right now. Look at this. Whoa. This is the boiler, right? Yeah, this is the boiler where they have uh, the wheat and the barley. And like later, they'll like run it through the filter and then they'll add like hops and uh, aromas. When you get really close here, the smell of beer. You just smell it. Oh, so good. Malt. This is the beginning of everything, right? Without this, there is no beer. Exactly, exactly. Oh, come on, Jos, come on, Jos. Nazdrovi. Thank you so much, my friends. Boom. <laughs> Golden ale. 
Oh, it's so good, man. Wow, light, no? No, more Focus. cacol, yes, light. Light, super light. Perfect summer beer. Mm -hmm. Black Sea, relax, Batumi. Mm -hmm. So that's your favorite one? I don't, I don't know, I, I think the dark, the dark Czech lager right here. They're also different. Is it bitter? Yeah, not so bitter, not too much. Bread beer. Bread beer. <laughs> this is non alcoholic. No alcoholic. No alcoholic. No alcoholic. <laughs> yeah, it's a. <laughs> it's basically just like drinking bread. Mm, but it's, yeah. it's really nice. It's almost like it has cinnamon. Mm. All right, we're gonna go back into the office. We're gonna have a few beers. And he has a secret for me. I don't know, I don't know what he's talking about. A secret. Gosh, my friends here are like, you have to be the boss today. I'm already the boss, but it's fine. He gave me, oh man, this is a liter? A liter of dark. And we have freaking crazy spread here. We have nuts, we have cheese, we have pork. We have like these little yummy fritters. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Saucy, bro. You got to be this one. Mm -hmm. Wow. Here we have chicken wings. We have an entire pork leg here. We have some uh, some more pork over there. So there's different cuts here. And this is like a... Yeah, whoa, what do we call this? So I got a piece of jerky here. Well, jerky, yeah, but it's, it's like... It's not salty, it's just like oily. Mm-hmm. Very good spread. I don't think I'm gonna eat all this. We still have a lot of food to go. This guy's like holding me down. He's like, you have to drink. I'll drink a little bit. I won't drink the whole thing. I won't touch it. They bring ingredients from Russia to make the spicy mustard. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, super spicy. Yeah. <laughs> so good. This pork has been boiled in this beer. So the dark. Right? And then after that, they fried it up, right? It was fried, not smoked. Fried. Mm. I'm gonna grab the whole thing plus into the spicy. <laughs> yeah, right there. I know this guy's laughing. He's like, you crazy. Crazy man. Crazy man. My favorite mustard ever. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow, wow. It's good. It's good stuff. It's like really spicy. Gamardos! Gamardos. Yeah, you just said I'm very drunk. No, I'm not. It's, it's not so strong. If it was like 10%. Yeah, you look the same as you came here. I'm perfect, I'm perfect. All right, we're done with the beer. We're going down. He has a surprise for me. So funny, this guy, the best. So this right here is Maximus' gym for the youth. They learn how to box, how to fight. Epic, I just boxed a little bit. I'm out of shape right now, but next time I'll get back into it. So he says it's a non-profit gym for uh, underprivileged kids. I love what you're doing, man. Hey, cheers, man, cheers. That's great, that's amazing. All right, guys, we did it. Maximus Brewery, the best. Wow, you amazing. have to try this Absolutely beer. Amazing. Yeah. amazing beer, amazing people. Crazy, crazy. We had, this is a great experience. They're so friendly. They literally invited me into the house. Next time I come here, mm -hmm. I'll definitely do it. Next up, we're going to Ajara House. Ajarian House, yeah, Ajarian House. Wow, we ate so much there also. Like, there's their, <laughs> their special stuff, but yeah, we're gonna have some more uh, traditional Ajarian food. So this is like sort of a new end of Batumi. They're doing a lot of skyscrapers here. Um, yeah, a lot of modern buildings, um, a lot of construction, like even going on right now. Uh, yeah, and out here is the Ajarian house. We're gonna try some traditional Ajarian dishes. Here we have the Courtyard Marriott, which is like, man, what a beautiful building. So unique, it's a crazy skyscraper. Here is just condos, 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 never ending. This is the new side, right? This is completely new, modern Georgia. Nothing else like this in the country, not even Tbilisi like this. Yeah, not this all big. These skyscrapers, yeah, it's a totally unique. Uh, yeah, you are allowed to uh, buy an apartment, buy buy a condo, a house. Yeah, a lot of people do it. They like move to Georgia for the better life. All right, my friends, we are ready to eat. We have two different salads. We have oh my god, the best dishes ever. The yeah. signori, signori. Yep. And this one, yeah, this one's signori. This one is borano. Okay. That's uh, your. Uh, Cottage cheese, cheese, and like this pastry dough. And this Borano is a straight cheese boiled in butter. Awesome. And then over here we have the beef. Yeah, we have this uh, salt called Chacondrilli. 
Uh, so it's a uh, beef that's been stewed in uh, this plant, which Jordan is called kondari. In, Jor in English, it's translated as summer savory. Okay. And it's like it's, like it's topped with pomegranate seeds and uh, sauteed onions. And we have some wine from Anja. Yeah, he said it's a dry red saparavi, so it's probably a Cajetian wine. All right, the wine? Yeah. yeah. Let's try it. Oh, it's nice. Try. Let's try this food. Which are you trying? Oh, I go for the Burano. Uh, I'm going for Burano because it's, it's getting cold and we have to keep it hot. Yeah, right? Burano should be eaten piping hot, you know, like while the mm -hmm. cheese is still melty. Oh my god, it's amazing. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's still soft and chewy. Mm -hmm. Basically, nice string cheese mm -hmm. with butter. Well, and butter, and not just any ordinary butter. Butter from like free range cows in the Ajarian Mountains. Mm -hmm. And only here they know how to make the butter with this kind of level of fat and quality. Definitely fatty. Later we get a piece of bread. Let's go in. And so soak out. it all up. Yeah. Next up we have signori. Yeah, signori. So signori is these like wheat rolls uh, topped with a filling of like uh, cottage cheese, uh, butter, and garlic. Looks like they have some like herbs mixed in as well. So mm -hmm. it looks delicious. Mm. Yeah, mm -hmm. very different. Herbal, mm -hmm. creamy, nice yeah. wheat roll. Really, really soft and fluffy. Mm. And that's something we haven't tried before. Chakondrili. Chakondrili. Never heard of this one, but it's uh, made in a similar way to Chakapuli in okay. uh, Kakheti and uh, Chakinzuli in Guria. So like beef stewed, or like in Kajeti, it's lamb stewed in different herbs. If you're not from Georgia, you don't understand all these locations, but so many places, so many different things to eat. Mm -hmm. This one looks amazing, so it's beef, pomegranate, I'm ready. Mm -hmm. mm. Nice. Wow. Super wow. soft. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Super tender. Nice pomegranate, just grab a few of them. Pinch them really fast. Amazing. I'm a fan. I'm a huge fan too. So it's cooked, well it's baked, right? Mm. Yeah. Now it's like it's baked like in its stewed in its own juices. Kondari, uh, it's not a very well-known no uh, herb in the English-speaking world, but in English it's called summer savory. I've never heard about it. Yeah, and it's really, really common in Georgian dishes. You have the pomegranate seeds, mm -hmm. burst out. We skip the salads. We we'll get to it now, mm -hmm. but like I say, this alone, my favorite, you know, these two are jarring dishes, mm -hmm. or the staples, right? Mm -hmm. There's only a few, like four or five, yeah. but these are the ones. Yeah. Like this cheese, lots of dairy. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat this, I'm gonna nice. drink some cha-cha. Got my juice. Best way to wash it down. <laughs> Straight diesel. That ended my night right there. Woo! Ooh. It's too much. We're going backwards now. We're jumping on the salads. Here we have eggplants with walnut paste. I love this. This is uh, shredded carrots also with walnut paste and some uh, pomegranate. This I don't even know what it is. So this is gonna be some kind of green, like sometimes it's spinach, but I'm not sure. Maybe it's an, another wild kind of green. Uh, and it's gonna be mixed with walnut paste, garlic, different spices, and topped with pomegranate. So we have here like two of the threads that bring so much different Georgian food together, the walnuts and the pomegranates. So we had pomegranates earlier on the meat dish and in so many other Georgian dishes, like there's there's walnuts. So this is this is what uh, this is what makes Georgia right here. And this one's like uh, corn. This, yeah, this is a, a corn fritter. So we have a cornbread, uh, baked and uh, fried. They're similar all over the place, but every place has their own different recipe with their own mixture of spices. So even though you eat it once, like uh, like m many times, like you, it's always a unique experience. Very similar ingredients, but always different lands. So that changes everything. All right, cornbread. Mmm. Cornbread. Similar cornbread in the States. A little more crispy on the outside though. Mm -hmm. More charred, right? Yeah. So in West Georgia, the cornbread is kind of the staple of the family meal. In East Georgia, there's more of an influence on, on bread, on wheat bread. Mm -hmm. But in West Georgia, it's cornbread like all day long. All day long. Mm -hmm. Ten times a day. Mm. We like eggplant and walnut. Mm. All right. Carrots, so good, so fresh. Mm -hmm. 
And this is gonna be amazing. Right here. It's like creamy herbs. Almost like a creamy spinach. Yeah, it's like, it's like with this uh, green or whatever it is, they've got a lot of dill mixed mm -hmm. and it looks like some coriander as well. Was, yeah, so herby. Oh, perfect. Oh, this. A little bit spicy as well, too. Yeah, a tiny bit, right? I mm -hmm. felt that, like a little ting. Mm -hmm. I love the carrots, though. Thank you so much. Thank you. Maloba, maloba. The food was awesome. A few good drinks. Cha cha, so good. Now we're off to the nightlife in the center of Batumi. Let's go. We're going back to old Batumi. And there, well, it started to rain, but I hope we're gonna hit up some uh, different bars uh, in the old town. Uh, we'll hit up a few different places like Cha Cha Time, Popeye, and uh, what's the other one called? Sami Ludi. Sami Ludi? Yeah. What was that? Sami Ludi, I think it's a, a craft uh, beer bar. It's right next to Cha Cha Time. I think it's owned by the same people. Yeah, they're all like one block apart, right yeah. there next to our apartment. All right, it's running like crazy. Where are we going first? We're at this place called Popeye's Craft Bar. Craft Bar, they got beers and they got something that they make in-house. Yeah, it's looks like, like Nastovka they call it. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what it is, but I think it's like vodka infused with different kinds of fruit or other kinds of botanicals. Are we ready? Yes. All Let's right. do this. Okay. Okay, we take from... Yeah, right there, right there. Galmarjos. Galmarjos, Galmarjos, you ready? That was easy. That's very good. Mm -hmm. That was super light. This is super fruity. Yeah. Mm. He said if we drink five, you're done. This is yours. No, I have another place to go to. No. You have a red shirt. It's matching, matching color. Okay, cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Go, go. Go for yours. I can. Mm. So this is what this place is famous for. For this. They make it themselves. So it's like vodka infused with berries, very delicious, very easy to drink. Obviously, if you drink a flight, you'll feel it, but it's so good. It's not like one of these vodkas where you're gonna be like on the floor, right? I feel fine. Yeah, I feel perfect. I feel amazing. 30%? percent mm -hmm. Just about. And they also have craft beers. It's a dive bar, you know, right underground. You have like three seating areas with the bar area. Outside, obviously it's raining, but there's a few different tables. And uh, I feel good, I feel good. All right, we're running to the next bar, let's go. All right, dude, we got three beers. We have a lager, lager, APA, so American Pale Ale, and then over here we have a stout. What do you want to try? I'll go for the lager. All right, I'll try the APA. I'm American, so this is America. All right. Oh, it's good. It's tasty. Mm. It mine, mine's almost like a, it tastes more like a pale ale, super light and hops, nice and creamy, crisp at the same time. It's good. Yeah, no, it's nice, it's light, drinkable, a bit hoppy, more hoppy than your average lager. Yeah? But tasty. I'll try it next. Have a try. Look at this one. Mm. And this is like a small bar. You see all the beers on the menu right there? You got other beers like outside of draft, you also have bottle. And then upstairs, small area, relax, chill, drink with your friends. And that's it. And then over here we have the stout. Stout? Oh, that's my beer right there, man. Mm, it's like chocolate right here. Uh, you like the dark beers. It's I'll give it a try. It's like chocolate and espresso. This is like super like 7.5. Not that bad. Yeah. I don't know. The colors on these are really beautiful. Galmarjos. 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 And I love their glasses. It says Sami Ludi. Sami Ludi. Three beers in Georgian. And what about that? We're having three beers. Exactly. That was the point of this, right? Wow. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> it's cha cha time. Are you guys ready? Yeah, I'm absolutely ready. What are we doing? How we do this? This thing? I think use it as a chaser. This is a long <laughs> shot. All right, Galmar Joe's guys. Galmar Joe's. I'm never ready for that. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not ready. Oh, Woo. never ready for this. This is Nina. Better known as Nino the King. <laughs> I think of Tamar the King, man. Too many challenges already. 
<laughs> My man, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank Chacha you. time in San Melody. All day, all day. And that's it, my friends. We did a crazy night out. Brewery, restaurant, bar, bar, bar. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. Oh my God. Come to Georgia, drink alcohol. Drink alcohol. And you know what? It's raining like crazy. And this is how it is all year long, usually, because we're here in the mountains by the Black Sea. It's just raining, right? Yeah, it does get a little rainy here from time to time. But I even come here in like September, October, perfect weather, early spring, perfect weather. In the sum summer, a little muggy, but great time all the time. And yeah, it's very dark where we are, passing through some old school streets, 19th century basically, right? Yeah, beautiful architecture. And yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. Oh, my last night here in Georgia. Love you, Georgia.